So what do we do about other people? Yeah, because we can work on ourselves all we want. We can own and control our reaction and our actions. But what do we do when others put things upon us? When other people say things, do things that we find harmful or hurtful? I'm gonna give you the biggest lesson that I've learned and that I probably share with most people I work with. You are in control of your emotional response to every situation. In this sense, no one can ever hurt you. It might sound impossible because you might have been abused. You might have been hurt. You have felt those feelings. And let me tell you, the essence that you are made of, your heart, your spirit, is way bigger than your body. So they can hurt your body. They can put you in a prison even and a physical prison and a real prison. Like remember the story of Mandela? He was in prison for years and he was quoted saying that they could never ever own his soul. That even if he was in solitary confinement, his soul was free. So I know it sounds very hard to do and it, it is. And at the same time, it takes the belief and the understanding that in the essence that you are, you are always free. And what you make of it, how you decide to own that truth or not, will have you know, a very clear reflection in your experience. So let's practice this together. Next time somebody comes, tells you something hurtful, or something happens that you are discontent with, pause for a moment, take a breath, and see if there's the possibility there that you can own your emotional reaction. If you pay attention to about three fingers below your belly button, there's a place there that Thich Nhat Hanh, our Buddhist uh, teacher, calls the root of your tree. And when you're rooted in that tree, the, the waves of your emotion, the, the, the top of the tree that goes left and right with the, with the wind, cannot really affect you because you are rooted in the base so you practice being in that root often daily several times a day and when that emotion comes and it wants to uproot you it can't it's not so easy for it because you are root, you're rooted you see the things that other people say or do to us most times reflect their own pain their own injuries their own state of mind they're not about you at all. I hope this is helpful. Let me know in the comments if you can practice it and if you have any questions. Thank you.